Taking a look inside North Carolina's Greensboro Coliseum, round one of March Madness kicked off this afternoon. 64 teams vying for a national championship, including our very own Providence College Friars. They begin their journey tomorrow night against Kentucky. 12 Sports Director Maury Hirsch Gordon is with the team and joins us live now from North Carolina. Hi, Maury. Yeah, hey Kayla, the Friars are back in the big dance. It's the seventh time under head coach Ed Coley, the most for any head coach in program history. The, Fri the Friars took a charter down here to Greensboro yesterday afternoon. They got a nice meal last night and they continued to to watch film and go over their opponent who they face tomorrow in sixth seeded Kentucky out of the SEC. Here's some footage from today's practice. We just got off the floor inside the Coliseum, as is customary here in the first round of the NCAA tournament. The 40 minute practice is open to the media and the public, so plenty of Friar fans getting the opportunity to support the team. As for the guys, we spent some time with them in the locker room this afternoon, and you could feel the renewed excitement to put their three game skid behind them and have a chance to compete on this stage. I mean, it's the best time of the year. I mean, you know, it's already been an upset. So, you know, we're trying to get one tomorrow, you know, um, against Kentucky, and we're just hoping for the best. I can't tell you how excited I am to be here. It's really, really hard to get to this stage. And to be on this dais is something we've always dreamed about. I've always dreamed about. Our players have dreamed about. And I do not take this day for granted. It brings joy to my soul and tears to my eyes to be sitting here to know that we are playing in March Madness representing the Big East. I am so excited. Everybody who grows up wants to play in March Madness, so now that you're finally here, um, especially since I didn't make it last year, uh, it's just a great opportunity for us to go out there and show what Providence can do. And moments after the locker room opened when we talked to the guys, it was really cool. They had a TV in there and they were watching the end of the Furman Virginia game. Furman hit a buzzer beater, the 13 seed to upset the four seed. Providence has the same idea tomorrow as they are the 11 seed looking to upset eight time national champion Kentucky. We'll have more reports coming up tonight at five. For now, we're live in North Carolina. Maury Hirsch Gordon, 12 News.